All right, so today we get to tear this thing apart. Yep. So we're going to drain all the fluids, take out the radiator core support, so just a lot of disassembling. The harness is disconnected, power steering disconnected, AC disconnected, front core support disconnected. We're gonna pull it out like this, and just lift up a little bit and it should just slide right out. Uh, problems. We are trying to tackle really rusty bolts that's holding the exhaust together and hopefully get the drive shaft out. Surprise, surprise. Damn. So easy. Yeah. Yep. 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 Here we go. Problem solved. Alright, so today Paulo is not here. He's busy, but um yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to make do without him. So with the transmission, we don't have everything that we need for it. As you can see, it's missing the bell housing, the clutch release, fork, and whatnot. So I'm waiting on that. And um, yeah, if only the, the delivery would get here on time. Because I don't live here, I got a mouse trap. Oh. Poor Bug. Evan here stepped on Bug it. trap. <laughs> Look at that. Oh god, no. Oh man. Well, <laughs> lesson learned, be careful. Yeah. 
<laughs> watch where watch you're where, walking. Watch where you're stepping here. Oh my god. Oh. That's never coming off. <laughs> Actually, a decent amount came off. You're gonna get stuck. Yeah, it's, in the yeah. everywhere you go, it's gonna be like. You're gonna pull it right off your foot. <laughs> this is garbage. Right there. <laughs> do we got like Goo Gone or something like that? Um, I do have brake cleaner. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. So yeah, gotta take off the shifter. Four bolts. Get that out of the way. Remove the drive shaft. And hopefully, we'll get this motor out of here in time. Drive shaft out. Do you got the front? Yeah. Hold on. Do you want to put the jack stand back underneath it? Yeah. There we go. Uh, got it. Watch your, uh, watch your head. Okay, here we go. All right. Uh, it's out. Uh. It only took okay. us like an hour and a half. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Because we're trying to get the back of the bitch. There we go. Okay. I, you need more torque on it. Mm -hmm. WD40 is our best friend for this? Yeah. Lazy though. Lazy and don't want to waste it. Orange. I have a gun. Why don't I use that? Because old school. Oh, like ABS is annoying. Damn. We're going to be re removing that guy. Sit rip. Basically, transmission is just about loose. You loosen the mounts up here for bolts. Took out the slave for the clutch. We have it zip tied here, just hanging loose. Tom is reaching for the engine mounts. Oh, this and okay. yeah. And they're good. You guys so, stop. for some reason, we're missing the hooks on the front part of the motor. You got the back ones, but not the front one. Maybe because it's the GE, and I don't know, they might have designed it differently. But what we're looking for is this guy. And sure, we can take this one out, but uh, let's do that later. Later. <laughs> we don't have much time. Yeah, so we're gonna use ratchet straps because it does the same job, does the same job. Yep. Okay. 
I would have Wait, did you just step in the. No. Oh, thanks. <laughs> okay. Step right in the bucket. Oh. Uh. <laughs> oh, okay, this is good. This is good. <laughs> Alright guys, so I think that's a wrap for this episode. It took a lot longer than we thought it would take, um, but we got the motor out and we can begin working on the other motor and we have all this space now. <laughs> so yeah, hope you enjoyed the episode. Please like and subscribe and um, stay tuned because we're going to get a lot more stuff done here and yeah. We're gonna get there! We're gonna get there! Yeah! Alright guys, take it easy! Um, so I think we have a problem. Like, we just made the car worse. Uh, as you can see... We failed the shoe test! <laughs>